My client's simply not interested in a divorce. Great. Well, uh, what will it take to interest your client? Okay, so here's the deal. You have screwed up my life, and I want to know why couldn't you find yourself in our marriage? Why didn't you say what you were thinking? I did. You never listened to me. No, you never said, hey, you know what? You suck. I'm deeply unhappy. You just took off. You never gave me a chance to address any of those problems. It's not fair. That's just quitting. I took vows to death, and I take them seriously. I believe this is just a phase, and I'm willing to wait it out. You're always waiting, Stephen. Waiting for me to come home, waiting for me to want to have kids, waiting for me to make you dinner. I don't understand why we cannot accept that we don't want to live in unhappiness anymore. Okay, I accept the fact that I'm occasionally unreliable and I often get sidetracked, but I thought you liked that about me. I thought it was okay that I had hopes and dreams. Yeah, have a dream, Stephen. Great, fine. Do that. Pick one. Okay, I pick one. I pick one. Oh. I mean, this is awful, but I truly believe with every molecule of my body, that you will find the person that wants just what you want and gives you what you want and you deserve. I am not her. No. Well, you obviously know nothing about her. But I kind of would like to submit a song that he believes is relevant to these proceedings. Go something like this. Are you kidding? Quitter, quitter, quitter. All right, all right, look. How about I take the blame for this? I'll be the one who could not deal with another weekend roaming down the aisles of a super store 